Hey guys, Brad M73 here. Welcome back to another episode of Farming Simulator 22. As always, do not forget to hit that like button. What else? Leave comments. I always love hearing from you guys. And if you have not done so already, please subscribe for this and many more videos. Also, massive shout out, massive, massive, massive to all of my subscribers. We just hit 93,000 subscribers uh yesterday actually which was what, what, what day was that february 6th of 2022 so thank you all so much i am oh do i not have automatic i don't yeah i just um just hit 93,000 yesterday could not believe it um, I've been making videos for uh, the upcoming game Model Builder, uh, which actually releases tomorrow on February 8th. I've really been enjoying that game. and But I've been having major problems with my iMac. And so I'm not exactly sure. I think I'm just going to bite the bullet and probably, maybe, I don't know, take a few days um because i'm gonna need to do a full system backup and then once i do that i'm gonna have to do like a full operating system restore which i've actually never done on an imac so i'm a little bit um scared about that but if that doesn't fix the problem i'm not exactly sure at this point what i'll do because i'm gonna i'm, I'm actually going to need to like buy a new iMac or something and like the current model that's basically the equivalent of what I have is like four grand and I can't really afford to do that right now or or like anytime maybe until like late this year so um, I don't know I just I'm really kind of been frustrated here lately with um with that whole thing because it's really preventing me from putting out content faster um, it's just been running so slow and I don't know it's just I've just been oh gosh no 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 like I've been getting this weird screen burn-in issue which I think is fake because I was having absolutely no problems until the update a few months back. I want to say it was in September. And then all of a sudden I start getting this weird, very weird screen burn in. But then it goes away and it comes back. If I, if I, it, it doesn't look like real burn-in. I've seen what real screen burn-in looks like. And when you turn a monitor off, it, it doesn't go away. Like, you can still, you can f actually physically see it on the monitor, even on these OLED screens. But, you know, it's so weird because I will maybe change to a different program. And then, like, sometimes it instantly goes away, sometimes it kind of fades away over the course of maybe five or ten minutes it's just really weird and to that end i'm i'm just not sure like is apple trying to do like a one uh, you know are they trying to pull one over on us by making fake screen burn in effects or something. I don't know. That's probably not what's going on, but it's just really bizarre. So we've got a bunch of grass um, to pick up. We've got some, I uh, still have more mowing to do. Do, do, do. I've been, but I've, I've been kind of looking 
forward to doing this all weekend, but I was having problems with uh, Model Builder and um, so I got those issues resolved and then I'm going to edit the videos and it's like my Mac is just so slow. And what's even weirder is it's like incredibly low. It's not like it's like the CPU usage causing the problem. It's actually like, because my CPU usage, it'll be rendering out a video and the CPU usage is like 30%, where it should be at like at 100%. And it kind of ramps up to maybe 50% sometimes and the fans turn on, but then, yeah, it's so freaking weird. So anyway, that's what I was doing all weekend this weekend. <laughs> But it is 8.52 in the morning here in October on my farm. And we've got all day to do stuff. Oh, I actually need to check and see. I think when I drop off this next bay, I'm gonna check and see. Oh. There we go. Let's um let's look really quick and see. Yes, yeah, so we've got some spraying missions. Oh, I actually Okay, that's herbicide. All right. Um I think I'm going to drop the trailer off. And then I need to find the sprayer. What did I do? What did I do with the sprayer? Oh, I forgot to mow the lawn over here, too. Okay, the sprayer's over here. Whee! We're <laughs> like bouncy, bouncy over the grass. All right, uh, let's see. So spraying is field 38 which is actually going to be right over here. Somewhere right over here. And we got the Toby Eye Tracker going again. If you want to pick one up for yourself, use my referral code uh, and a referral link down in the video description. When you check out, you know, save 5% off, which is a little bit of a help. Oh, let's go ahead. But yeah, you just check out, use code BRADM73, and you'll save 5% off on your Toby Eye Tracker. It is definitely game changing. I think it's PC only, though, so sorry, console guys and girls. Do 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 I think I'm kind of going to do like a headland here because I want to we don't have a whole lot of herbicide left and I want to make sure we maximize the amount of coverage we get with what we have <clears throat> and I still I still have not figured out what those little pits are see that little pit there there's like one there they're like all over the map Literally no one from Giants has been like, this is what they are. I have never seen anything that looks remotely close to that. Maybe it's like secret entrances to the, the alien 
civilization that lives below ground? No, I don't know. I'm sure that's not what it is. No, we've only got 20% left. This curved part is going to be the hard part. So I just kind of want to... You know, go down this line here. Actually, there's quite a bit of room at the end of this... This field edge right here. So I could almost hire the worker. I just don't know if he's going to stop and, like, do something really weird. Seventeen percent left. Okay, now it's going to kind of come to... Kind of a little bit more of a difficult part, because you've got really strange field geometry, but we're also trying to maximize <clears throat> how much herbicide we're going to use here. Oh! Oh, now... This is going to be... Oh, gosh, we're on 15%. I think we started at 23%. Uh. Look at that. All right, very good. And we've got a couple little spots there, but I think as far as maximizing your herbicide, that's gonna be pretty darn good as far as coverage goes. Okay, so I'm just going to go ahead and hire the worker here. Oh, I almost want to do the... There we go. <laughs> I was going to say, I almost want to do the mowing manually, but I doubt that I, I, doubt that I will. Look at how many bales we have. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20 on this field alone. There's 21. 
We're, we are just going to have a ridiculous amount of bales. And come December, when we go to sell them all, we are going to be in the money. It is going to be so awesome. And the game is loud. I'm so sorry about that. Oh, you remember the other day when I said I wanted compass mode? Um, somebody brought up the point that there is kind of a compass mode with the mini-map, but not really. It does point north, but I would actually rather have like a heading, um, you know, like a heading at the top of the screen, or maybe, I don't know, some, some kind of more physicalized compass, I think. I, I just don't know. I don't know. All right, well, he's wrapping up. Oh gosh, we're at eight percent. I don't know if we're gonna make it. Oh, you remember when? <laughs> remember in the old olden days when I was like, "Hey, look, we're playing like Farming Sim Mobile." I would like zoom all the way out and pretend I'm playing a mobile game. If that were the case, it would look like one heck of a good mobile game. I'm just gonna say that right now. Um, uh-oh. Wait, something happened. What happened with my Mac? I'm, I'm actually trying to render out a video right now, and it's not showing. Why, why is it doing this? I don't understand. I'm going to just try to reboot it, because this is just getting redonkulous. While I am doing this, I'm going to restart it a few times, just to, just in case that fixes something. Maybe there's like an update I need to install. Ah, what am I doing? <clears throat> Look at this, I missed all kinds of chunks. Not that it's worth going back and getting these, but I'm going to do it. Oh my god. If there's one thing I freaking hate about Steam on the Mac is I always set it to not start when I reboot my Mac. And guess what? It always starts up when I boot up my Mac. Every freaking time.
Okay. Doo -doo 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 -doo. So I'm like kind of multitasking here today, I think. I'm both trying to play Farming Simulator and trying to get my computer to work. I've been I've been trying. I, I literally was so stressed out about it. I went to bed early last night. I woke up at about 2.30 this morning uh, to actually work on the video. Tried rendering it out twice. The sun was coming up this morning. Um, like when I got up. Well, no, when I went to bed, the sun was coming up. That's what I'm trying to say. Uh, and... <laughs> yeah, it was... I think I... So that was probably... I don't know what time sunrise is here. Um, right this time of year. But... I went to sleep. And I woke up probably a little after noon. And... And I have been working on this problem now for about four hours. Like, no joke. Uh-oh. Can I get that? Yes, I can. I'm coming for you, Mr. Moa Man. Let's back up again. All right, so I've restart. Let's see, are there any, so there's no updates popping up. Let me see. I'm, re I'm gonna run software. <gasps> no, not in the middle of the road. Okay, phew. That'd have been hilarious if I like pooped the bale out there <laughs> and it came back and all kinds of cars were hitting it and getting stuck. Oh gosh, Mac OS Monterey. What do I have? I didn't think I could upgrade it. Oh, I've got Big Sur. Maybe that's the problem. I would have swore I got a message saying that I was not, like my Mac couldn't be upgraded to Monterey, even though like all the hardware in it is still like really good. I mean, yeah, it's from late 2015, but the, the CPU I got in it at that time was like the best one that they had. And it's still a good processor even to this day, especially if we're just doing video rendering and stuff like that. I don't know. I don't know what to do. It's like, it's one of those issues that, you know, yeah, money can solve it, but I just ain't got that kind of money laying around. Ugh. Money is the root of all evil. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, let's head down here. Was Monterey the one that came out back in September? Because I thought I somehow downgraded from that or... Or it... No, I was trying to update to it. Ugh. Um, let's see. I don't want to upgrade to that. No. Okay. No. No. Alright, I'm going to restart it again. And then I'm going to go back to mowing. Oh gosh, we need to check on the the sprayer, don't we? 
And of course he ran out. Alright. Alright, so we are going to need to ship him off. Oh, up here to the store. Is that right? Is he moving? Okay, he's moving. All right. Okay, we got the mower there. All right, continuing on. And then I think... I'm actually going to try to rein in this crap. Yeah, there we go. Now, I don't know if I try to hire a worker right now. I don't know what's going to happen. I love them. I'm just gonna I'm gonna mow around the field here. Somebody mentioned the other day that the, uh, the mower needs a good wash. It looks dirty, yes, and I think it looks awesome. Look, look how awesomely dirty that thing is. I think I'm gonna start it right here. And then we're gonna hire the worker. Yeah, why is the hired worker not cutting outside the field boundary? I want him to. I also want to make sure it's going to make a left turn. Yeah, I think we're good there. Okay, let's go ahead. Oh, the fertilizer spreader's up here. Is it 2,000? Yeah. All right. That'll be more than enough. Um, set destination. <clears throat> I'm just going to set it back there.
All right. Another one already? Oh my gosh! See, this is something that I would like to to use course play for. Like, like mowing grass is like the perfect excuse to use course play. Because it'll stop, you know, for every bale. It'll drop off the bale. It'll continue on. It won't skip a beat. Uh, I feel like doing... I feel like doing that head row back there, but, but I won't. Alright, so the mower, he's almost finished. I kind of, oh gosh, I kind of get the feeling that I'm going to need to mow the rest of that myself. The, you know, way back there in the corner. I eventually want to make that corner kind of like, you know, nothing but... Maybe greenhouses or something. All right. Pretty sure I'm gonna be able to cover this with, yep. Okay, contract on field 38 is finished. I'm not even gonna bother with the rest of it. Um, so we'll collect that. I'm not gonna do this harvesting job 
Um, we do have another spraying uh, job. So that's on field 59, which is where? Right over here. Okay, so we're not too terribly far away. So we'll, we'll take that bridge over there, kind of just to the left, now straight ahead. We'll take this bridge. Well, you know, I really wish we had more harvesting contracts because that looks harvestable there. There's probably, I don't think the sunflowers are harvestable yet. I'm not sure this, see, this is a field that we could do herbicide on. Actually, it looks like it needs more of a cultivating than herbicide. Guys, we are going to have so much money. Yeah, this is the other... Come on now. There we go. We are going to have so much money when we get done... Well, when we hit, what is it, December or January? We're really going to have to pay careful attention to what crops we have and when we sell them. Okay, so, whoops. So I need to go boom, lower. I think I just want to go ahead and finish mowing everything. And then we'll only have to worry about bagging it all up. Well, not bagging, but you know, you know what I mean. Or maybe you don't. Wait a sec. See what I'm doing here? This is probably not at all how you would mow in the real world, but heck, I'm doing it, so there. little tiny bit here <laughs> not it's not even worth me mowing I don't even know why I'm mowing this but I am so there we go um, I also feel the need to come in here and mow this I'll be able to access all this or as much as I need to to mow through this. Just 
mow around the property here. It's really hard to see where these trees are, and I don't want to nail the trees. his task, I think that's probably the worker who was spraying the herbicide. If it wasn't him, then I'm going to be slightly concerned. This, is, this right here is going to be the end of the mowing, as we know it. <laughs> All right. And I guess I could... I guess I could park him for now over here by the the sprayer, but I don't think I'm going to spray just yet. Uh, we're going to check on... Really? Okay. Oh. Yeah, spray half the neighbor's field, why don't you? <clears throat> Looks like he didn't even spray up in this area. Let's go a little bit narrower here. Now the contract on field 59 is finished. So we'll collect that. And we just have this fertilizer job. So why don't we... I'm just going to have him set the, the home destination there. And then we're going to go and continue bailing. And hopefully I can get all this, <clears throat> this bailing done in this episode. And I'm going to try one last time to render this video because I am just at wit's end. And we'll see. I, I've cut like 10 seconds out. I, it, it keeps saying that I have bad frames or like a corrupted frame. But... I know that I don't. If I go to the frame in, in any other editor, it looks fine. There's no corruption. There's no... It's It's got to be something to do with 
this latest update because it never used to do that and then like i said i don't know if it was late august or september or whenever that was all of a sudden my mac just started having all these problems But I persevere, and I push through it. <laughs> Just gotta push. It's like those times when you're constipated. You just gotta push through. Okay, never mind. There it goes. Terrible joke. Terrible joke, Brad. Okay. at all these look at all those bales guys that is going to be mega money Don't poop it on the road. It's kind of the one thing I don't like about the automatic bail dispensing or whatever you want to call it. Again? Oh my god. Oh gosh. Just going to have him cut this bale loose. Ninety nine. Ninety nine says this balance. Okay.
another one. <laughs> this is so freaking crazy. Come on. I think I'm gonna cut down here. We're not cutting actually, we are picker uppering. Oh, in other news, um, I picked up a copy of Ghostbusters Afterlife like a week ago, and it finally got delivered yesterday on a Sunday of all days. I guess the big snowstorm and ice storm must have delayed it, but what was really weird was it, it actually, as, as far as Amazon's page told me, it didn't even ship until Saturday. I ordered it, I think, last Monday or Tuesday. But anyway, it is a masterpiece and an absolutely wonderful movie. Definitely in line with, like, the old ones. And I would be totally happy if they continued on that line. Not like the, what is it, the 2015 or 2016. Um... You know that one was a, a disaster. Which whatever year that that one was, and you know the one I'm talking about, or maybe you don't. I don't know. It's better that you don't know because it's it's it is a it's not it's not even funny. It's just horrible on every just about every level. Um, but the new one, absolutely perfect. I loved it. I almost cried at the end. I was like, man, that they just really did a good job. And so, uh, yeah, the spirit, ha ha ha, of Ghostbusters is definitely uh, alive in that movie. So, really enjoyed that. And aside from, you know, trying to, uh, you know, edit these videos and work around all these issues with my iMac over the weekend... <clears throat> that was about all I did all freaking weekend. I take that back. My I did my mother did come over. Uh, we had dinner. We watched Ghostbusters together and that kind of stuff. So um, do, 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 do. Did it? Okay. But I think what, yeah, I think I'm gonna, I'm gonna make the decision to to actually I guess I'm gonna have to take my old time machine back up and delete it even though it's from like I don't know how many years ago <laughs> I literally think it's like from 2015 I like never back my stuff up 
Uh, but I think I'm going to have to do that. And then, um, why did I just set through that? That whole wrapping? Um, I just got to get it done because I, I, I want to... There's so many more videos that I want to do and everything that's keeping me from doing them is my slow iMac, which shouldn't be slow. It's just incredibly frustrating. Okay, off we go again. Oh my, I don't even want to count these. I mean, I do, but oh my gosh. Oh, 91. I keep thinking I'm gonna have to stop really quick. <laughs> All right. I don't know. Don't ask what I'm trying to sing because I don't even know. I don't know. I don't know these things. I just want to get all of this done. So, I still have that full field to go. Jeez. <laughs> we have so freaking bad. This is just absolutely redonkulous. We are going to have so many. I don't even know where to put them all. I'll have to put them back here somewhere. Now, I don't think this is like full like growth grass. I don't know how you would how do I describe this because this isn't actually on the field so I honestly think this grass isn't as dense uh oh don't roll in do not roll into the woods. Oh my gosh. No, I, I'm like, no, just, no. <laughs> it's better that I not show my farming weaknesses right now. 
All right. Oh, 90, 100. go wait it's hard to see there we go that's better okay stopping again Okay, oh, <laughs> missed a spot. I missed a spot. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna do the rest of this field. I'm just gonna go, we're gonna keep recording here. Um, let's see. Um, oh my gosh, it's been an hour already? I can't believe it. <gasps> I'm gonna have to like stop and eat some dinner. I'm like, I have my Mac screen like turned off so that I'm not distracted and yet I'm constantly wanting to like look and see if the video has failed yet again. Because if it, if it has, I'm just gonna barf. Because I've been, I mean, it's literally more than 12 hours me trying to get this video to work. I guess I'll just continue going around. And it's only 9.50 in the morning, Elm Creek time. So we still have plenty of time. We have a ton of stuff to do in this day of this episode. We still have to pick up all the, look at all those bales. That is just crazy. We still have to pick up all the bales. We're gonna have to mulch all these fields. Um, and on top of that, we are going to need to, uh-oh. Gosh. I guess I'm just gonna go down this way. <laughs> um, let's see, yeah, we've got a mulch. We have to cultivate, probably pick up rocks again. Well, my CPU is still running pretty hot. 
It's right about one third finished with the render on the video. So that's good. I'm knocking on wood right now. Um, because that's usually where it fails out pretty close to now. So I don't know. We'll see. We'll see what happens. I'm keeping my fingers crossed. Why am I doing this? Why am I doing it this way? I don't know why I'm doing it this way. I'm just like driving in circles. Whoa. Let's go down this road. I'm gonna go down right down this old road. I'm gonna sit on the commode. Wait. I think that's a completely different song. And of course, I plop that bale out right on top of that little tiny tuft of grass. See if I can get it. Can you see it? And I didn't even get it. Yay! Yay for me! I'm the be Beset's farm. Oh my gosh, it never ends. Like just when I think that I'm gonna get some distance. No, I do not. So I'm going to finish up this little corner field here. Oh my gosh. Oh, watch out, Mr. Bale. No, don't go into the creek. Oh no, it's going it's going to. He's he's lost forever. What are we gonna do, Scoob? <laughs> oh, he's still going. Look, he's way up there at the top right. He's like, I wanna go for a drink. Ugh. gosh we have so much more to do I know I know I'm going down through here and not 
back to the field. I kind of want to do this area first. Oh, look, we can just like poop the bales out right here. I'm going to be like, where did this extra bale come from? Come on. I just want to get rid of this bale. This one's going to be tough to steer through. I guess it wasn't too terribly bad. holding my breath going around these turns, making sure I'm trying to pick these these things up. Let's see, how are we doing? Ooh, there's the train. How are we doing? We're doing all right on time. I'm a little bit over my hour. I, why, do I, why do I always go over an hour, like always? I tell myself I'm not gonna film for more than, or I'm not gonna record for more than an hour. And yet I do every flipping episode. I hope you guys really appreciate all of this time that I put. <laughs> that I put in. It's all for you guys. Uh-oh. I kind of thought that bale was going to go rolling off into oblivion, too. I'm pleasantly surprised that it didn't. Oh, one of the other things I actually do need to check which I think I checked a few episodes ago, but the water in the in the uh, greenhouses.
All right. At least I can get this. I could probably get all this done in this episode. And then we'll have to do like the, the pickup in the next one. Because I, I, I literally don't know where I'm going to keep all this. Look at that. Look how many bales there are. There's got to be at least 50 or 60 bales there. So let me do a freeze frame. <laughs> Count them all. I mean, I'm guessing I'm going to have at least four trailers full of bales, not including the bales that I've already got, which I think is like three. That's just crazy. The next question then becomes, do I want to mow and, well, no, I don't think I'm going to have nearly as much area to mow in December because, again, we're going to be putting wheat down. But I think to move forward with, with doing grass, I'm definitely going to have to do some kind of a course play route for sure. And that would entail me downloading course play. I don't know if that's in the mod hub right now or not. I think it might be. I have actually had some people ask me. Well, tell me and ask me. Like, tell me, hey, the course play uh, mod is available. And then ask me if I'm going to do videos on it. <laughs> and I'm like, I don't know. I kind of don't. I want to try not to. I always... You know, I'm a purist when it comes to video games. I don't like, mo you know, using a whole lot of mods. Um, and I always try to play a game as close as possible to how it was intended by the author or, you know, developer of the game, etc. Because I think when you don't do that, when you go against that, then you know, you're kind of ruining the experience of the game. And I'm, I'm honestly trying to recall instances where I have run mods where it's actually enhanced the experience. The only thing I can really... The only thing that really comes to mind is the, the Skyrim high-resolution texture mod which was like a high resolution texture pack that I, I don't know if a player, not a player, but a modder did that originally. I think it was a modder originally. And then I think they, I think they then offered it. I don't know if there, it was like officially redone. I don't know how that all worked. I kind of lost touch with the, uh, Skyrim community when I stopped caring about it. I mean, I mean mainly not, like not playing it all the time. Though I was never like super hardcore. I think I played through Skyrim. I know I played all the way through at least three times and possibly as many as five times, though I don't know if I finished it all five of those times. I know I finished it at least three times. Because, oh, just trying to remember. Like, I, I always try to do, like, one run without using magic and then an an another run using magic. But there's always, like, some point in the game where, like, the non-magic user character has to use some kind of magic. Anyway. Oh, 
But I've I've honestly had more problems with mods, and I think I think that's mainly a result of you know people that know nothing about coding and programming wanting to create content for a game that they love. I'm I'm not faulting them, but a lot of times it results in way sub you know substandard mods that could ruin your save files or you know corrupt other game files. Now well usually usually um, it's not gonna corrupt your game files but it could corrupt your save if the mod does something really weird and you know especially if it's not something that's vetted by by giants Uh, you know, you, I, there's a ton of modding sites where, especially on PC, where you can get a lot more mods. Than just the ones that Giants offers on the mod hubs. And those are the ones that are generally a lot more dangerous. I definitely stay away from that, those. Alright, two more lines and we will be finished. We're kind of on the home stretch. Gosh, we. There's like 40, at least 40 bales just right there. That is knocking nuts. Very nuts. Oh gosh, my dinner's in the oven too. So I, ha I just have it set to like a low temperature to kind of warm it up. I made this like chicken, broccoli, cream of chicken, cheese, and like biscuit kind of thing, concoction. I won't even call it a soup. A souffle? Is it a souffle? No, it's not a souffle. I don't know what a souffle is. I can't think of what it is off the top of my... No, it's no souffle. Um, but um, anyway, I made that for dinner yesterday. And, uh, and I still have, like, leftovers today. So that's what I'm having for dinner. Leftovers. You know what I haven't had in a long time and I've been really wanting lately? is pizza. I haven't had pizza in probably like a month. Maybe more than a month. If I eat all my chicken dish, maybe I'll order a pizza tomorrow. If I end up um, fixing my mat, maybe. Done with the mowing and the bailing. 
Oh my gosh. Look at all those freaking bales. I mean, okay, there's even one way out by the telephone pole there. I mean, if you want to go and just count all of those, we got even more over on the other side. Oh my gosh. This is absolutely crazy. So I don't know when I'm gonna, if I, if this video, actually, let me, let me go back over. I'm gonna finally look. It's, it shows halfway rendered. That is a very good sign. We're down to like the 50% mark. Um, so if, if it's truly halfway rendered and we can get it all the way rendered, I might actually try to get this video out um, tomorrow and get the, what is it, Model Builder episode up tonight. And then after that, I'm, you know, it's going to depend on how quickly I can get my Mac backed up and, um, and get everything reinstalled or reformatted or something. I don't know how that's going to all work. <sighs> so, uh, like, I can't really say I'm having anxiety, but... It def there is a level of anxiety that comes along with that. All right, here's our last bit of grass and like there's a couple little bits out here on the field. I don't know if it's enough to make a whole other bale, probably not. We're at 46, yeah, I don't think so. I wonder if I can get right underneath. I don't think it's gonna let me. Oh, we might have gotten that. This chunk, 48%. Four, this is gonna be 49%, maybe, maybe not. Hey, 49%. All right. Well, that is gonna be it, guys. Um, thank you all so much for joining me for another episode of Farming Simulator 22. Um, as always, oh my God, as always, be sure to count all the bales. Look at that. Look at that. Can I jump up on a bale? Oh my gosh. Look at all those freaking... It's going to take like an entire episode just to pick all those up. Just about. It, maybe not an entire episode, but... Bale picker uppering. But look. We've got those stacks there. We've got another stack there. Plus we've got the straw here... And then there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Can you believe we got seven bales just from this area? Seven bales just from that. And that's like, you know, that's going to be... I mean, if we get a minimum of 1700 per bale. I think we get about 1750 That's $12,000 right there. And we may get more than that during the winter time. I'm not exactly, I can't really re remember exactly what the number is, but it is not insignificant. So um, stick around for more Farming Simulator 22. Um, as always, don't forget to hit that like button. Leave comments. I always love hearing from you guys. If you have not subscribed, well, subscribe because I want to be thankful to you as well as all of my other 93,000 subscribers. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, we'll see you next time. I'm Bradham73. Thanks again for watching and bye for now.